Now, the end of the year 2023 also marked the end of an era for Denmark's queen, Margrethe II, the longest serving monarch of Europe. Following the death of Britain's Queen Elizabeth II, now, it announced her surprise abdication on live television on the New Year's Eve. And she is now leaving the throne to her son, the Crown Prince Frederick. Listen in. I have decided that now is the right time. On 14 January 2024, 52 years after I succeeded my beloved father, I will step down as Queen of Denmark. I leave the throne to my son, Crown Prince Frederick. Well, the 83-year-old took over the throne from her father in the year 1972. In July, she became the longest sitting monarch in Denmark's history. This after a constitutional amendment allowed women to inherit the throne. Now, her abdication comes on the ground of understanding the medical implications following her back surgery. Who is the Crown Prince Frederick now? Let's look at that. Who is ready to succeed the throne? Well, known as the party prince in the early 1990s, he is the eldest child of Queen Margaret II and the Prince Henrik. He is the first Danish royal to complete a university education. Frederick served as a staff officer at Defence Command Denmark from the year 2002 to the year 2003. And a fun fact here, he was nicknamed Pingo. Crown Prince Frederick is married to Mary Elizabeth Donaldson, who is an Australian marketing consultant. The 55-year-old is known for his passion for the environment. He has vowed to guide the ship of Denmark into the future.